Hey there guys, welcome back to my channel. So if you want to make uh, a customized free watermark video like this from Render Forest, stick on to the end of the video to find out how. Alright, so welcome back to my channel, YSB Assignment. So today I'll be teaching how to remove Render Forest watermark from your video and how to add your free customized um, watermark. So step one, launch your web browser. So if you're using Google Chrome, launch your Google Chrome web browser. Alright, so log on to renderforest.com and create your animation video. So for those of you that don't know how to create an animation video on renderforest.com, you can check the link in the description below and you'll find a video dedicated to how to create an animation on renderforest.com. In any ways, you can watch this um, to learn how to quickly create an animation video in renderforest.com so you pick your templates i love the 3d explainer toolkit so i'll click on that okay so click on that and you select your scenes click on create now click on create video afterwards click on add scene okay so the idea is for you to create your own animation and on renderforest.com you have very very um well created scenes so you can pick any scene that matches the kind of story you want to tell so i'll be picking the conference and the airport scenes so for the sake of this video, since the main idea is to change or remove, customize render forest um, watermark and to add your own, add your own watermark for free using KineMaster, will make the animation creation very very short. So just watch for step by step process on how to do this quickly. So select the sound or audio you want. Click on free preview. Then export your animation by clicking on the download icon. So you can click on download your video and your 3d animation is ready now launch your kinemaster app click on the media icon and select the animation you created on renderforest.com okay so i've selected mine so you can see it still has the render forest watermark on it all right so first thing we're going to do is to remove the render forest watermark for free and next step will be to add a customized um, watermark. So the watermark could be anything you want. But first things first, you have to remove the, the, the watermark that came with that has render forest created on render forest on it. So first step, click on effects. Next, click on click on layer. Now trim the layer. Click on Gaussian blur. Now trim the Gaussian blur layer to the required um watermark size make sure it fits perfectly on the watermark now increase your blur strength click on settings and include increase your blur strength make sure it fits perfectly on it so it will look very professional now afterwards click on the gaussian blur highlight it and drag it to the end of the video so you can replay it so now you can see the created on render forest watermark has been completely um, covered the next thing is to add your customized uh, watermark so because i usually add ysb assignments which is the name of my um youtube channel i'm going to use that for this tutorial so you go you click on layer click on text on text you type in the text i typed in ysb assignments 
afterwards you edit the text a bit you can choose different color you can choose white you can choose font size could be bold or any kind of font size you want so i chose bold next i will reduce the animation using the icon there then i'll move and slant it then place it on the area where there was created on render forest watermark before so you keep resizing the watermark until you get the required size of watermark then place it on it as you can see now i have a customized watermark now drag it to the end of the video just like you did for the gaussian blow now click play and watch how you've created a customized watermark for free okay so you can also change the color of the phones of your customized watermark you can add the name of your channel as a customized watermark or you can remove the watermark and refuse to add uh, another watermark now next step is to export the video so if you don't know how to use kinemaster to edit videos you can check the link in the description below to learn how to use kinemaster to edit videos subscribe for more of this kind of videos and make sure you turn on the notification bell not to miss my next upload thanks a lot Please make sure you give a thumb up to this video if you like the video and leave your comments. See you in the next video.